What is up? Brian with Happy Thumbs Gaming here, and we've got some more LEGO Star Wars The Complete Saga for you. This is Episode 5, Chapter 3, The Falcon Flight Free Play. That's right, we're going to get all 10 of those mini kits. We're going to get the 4X Stud Multiplier. It's about time we find another one of those. And of course, we're going to get that 50K, which is pretty easy peasy. Now, i got to be honest, I really like the flying segments, and this happens to be one. Quick reminder, we do have quick links down below in the video description. You will need a TIE Fighter for this, so make sure that you have followed along with our Preparing for Free Play, and that you got that TIE Fighter all ready to go. If you are, let's go ahead, and as soon as you begin, we're going to go to the far right Star Destroyer here, as we've got the mini kid hiding on the far right side. Now, don't blink, things happen fast. Now, the next Star Destroyer just to the left, we've got another red brick hiding out. So, another collectible hiding. Booyaka show! It's kind of a funny angle, but make your way back there, and you should have no problem getting it. Now, we got to blast away a bunch of these cannons. Now, uh, each one of these large bad boys has, I believe, four cannons that need to be eradicated now uh, I'm going back kind of getting seconds here as you might notice there's a bunch of studs being left behind and my attract red brick is not doing its job very well it has to do with the way the studs move and how they drop down and now I actually missed the cannon right there check it out see that guy somehow I just forgot about it so we'll come back to him in just a second I actually swoop through and get all four of these guys on the first one pew, pew, pew. And of course double back to them studs Stack them up, stack them up, stack them! Now, of course, as soon as you get all of the cannons removed, so all 16 of them, it's actually going to just take you away to the next section, which is going to be where our next collectible is. So, uh, if you are in a hurry, don't forget to click that quick link for mini kit number two down in the video description. So, I've officially found the cannon, and pew, 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 pew. No, wait, is that it? That's it, isn't it? Go ahead and click that subscribe button. I think we got it. We did. All right. Don't forget to ring that bell as well. Woo to the woo. All right. As we start off, we've got a bunch of these blue asteroids. Those are going to become important in a minute as they are going to leave behind proton torpedoes. And we're going to need those to do some damage up ahead. But uh, first off, let's pay attention to the left side as there is a TIE fighter door. And inside, there is a bomb, 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 bomb dispenser. We're going to go ahead and switch on over to a vehicle that will actually allow us to tow one of these guys. And then it's definitely going to require some precision here, and you'll have to forgive me as I was lacking that. But I'll spin around, and one of these days I'm going to smack it, bang it, boom it, to the moon, Alice! One of these days to the moon! Oh, look at that, we're on the moon. And I got it! Woo! All right, so guess what? We're going to double down as there is another one over on the right, except for this one's a little bit tougher. you got to kind of plan your path. As you see here, I am not doing a, well, I'm doing a good job, a G-U-D job. Not 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 what one would think as a real good job. But here we go. I'm going to try to swoop around, and I believe I don't get it this time, too. I think somehow I lose it, and it goes in there. Yep. And for, let's see, take 746. Actually, the real joke is the level after this, man, I really struggled to find one of the collectibles as the story takes you on a little different path from the free play. And as a result, it really messed with me in the guide. So good thing that I'm going to go and address that in the next video. But boy, I think I played the level like six times. I'm not even kidding. And I'll explain it when we get there. But anyways, we're back out in the main asteroid field. And we're basically just going to stack up a bunch of these pink bombs. Or I believe they're the protons, right? Tell me if I'm wrong. Correct me in the chat or down below. Whatever it's called. I always forget. I'm so used to live streaming. I keep calling the, the uh, you know comment section down below the chat, which is not correct. But uh, what we need to do is make our way to the final asteroid. But on the left-hand side, we're going to find a minikit floating. So uh, as you get to this little uh, section here where you got to take out four of the pink balls here, you have gone too far. So make sure you double back and grab that minikit. Hey, uh, quick reminder, we do have a nice little break in between collectibles, mainly because I struggled to get a bunch of these proton torpedoes. I hope I'm, I hope I'm right on that. If I'm wrong, I'm never going to hear the end of it, especially like, you know, if Barry or Jerry or, you know, there's a handful of you that are really good about correcting me. You're, at least you're nice about it, though. You're not like, hey, dummy. <laughs> uh, usually you're like, I think you meant this. And you're right, usually I am wrong. So I, I've been botching things forever, hence the uh, Brianisms, right? I mean, I, I, one of these days I need to publish the book. I, I should start stacking them up. I know that uh, somebody out there too, I, I can't remember if it was Adam, somebody was actually stacking up a bunch of the Brianism words, and they even sent them to me. Yeah, it was Adam. I'm pretty sure it was Adam that sent that to me. 
We'll have to pull that out and use that as a good start because, you know, he even had like the sound effects in there, you know, like my and like all that kind of stuff. So it was kind of funny. I guess those are considered Brianisms too. Now, hey, as we make it into the next section here, wait a minute, this looks familiar. It's more blue asteroids in the middle of nowhere. Haha, -ha, you're going to want to pay attention to the right side this time. Last time everything was on the left, this time it's on the right. There we go. So connect that mini kit. Now, this next part right here, it's not very forgiving to me as we continue. Oh, no, actually, it's not this part. It's coming up. Never mind. There's another part that's just terrible. I struggled pretty Will, will laugh at me when I get there. Basically, what we gotta do is we gotta stack up three of these bombs, and we gotta go ahead and destroy the wall that kind of takes us up into the big asteroid. Now, I was looking at the guide, and the guide does say that there is a spot where there are pink spots on the ground you need to blow up, but we're clearly not there yet. So I, I was doing a little loop-de-loop -loop there just to make sure I hadn't missed anything, because you never know. You know, normally I do a playthrough, and I figure out where everything is, and then I come back, and I know where everything's at, and I'm good to go, and it's usually quick and efficient. This time I didn't. I kind of winged it. Ha-ha. <laughs> see, see what I did there? I winged, winged it? No? Boo? Okay. Uh, all right. Well, you got a couple of these bombs. I'm going to stack up all three again. Now, unfortunately, we can only take three at a time. I wonder if there's a red brick that allows us to carry more, or perhaps just gives us, like, infinite... I, I'm sure those are proton torpedoes. They gotta be... Uh, but we're going to go ahead and blast the final spot here. Now we can go ahead and advance into, well, it's actually a big open area. We're going to focus on both the left and the right. And then there's actually a down, too. What? I'll show you when we get there. Uh, there are, see these guys on the ground? Just go ahead and drop them like they're hot with some of them pink bombs. That's right. And there's two of them. One in the middle, kind of left almost, and one on the right. <laughs> All right, so we got both of those guys. Now we're going to pay attention to the far left side. Is, guess what? There is another door. Knock, knock. We got to pull out our TIE fighter, and in we go. As we get to that, ah, it's another one of these bombs. Ah, so we'll have to travel all the way back. In fact, I think there might be a section somewhere closer. I, I don't know. But once we go down, there might be a spot too. But just to play it safe, I went all the way back. And then, of course, this is where I, I totally get robbed. Like, I do not get what I'm supposed to get. Like, I'm taking out these asteroids. Look, okay, so I didn't actually take out the silver piece, which gives me the bomb there. But I took one out there, and I didn't get it. Now, watch. Watch in the background. It's going to spawn super late. Wait for it. Wait for it. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe it's just not going to appear at all. Oh, there it is. What's it doing way over there? I guess maybe one of my rogue bullets caught that. But uh, anyways, you got to stack up a couple of them. I, I just to play it safe. I grabbed, uh, I think I grabbed all three Maybe I just grab. Yep, I got three, and we are out of here. Now, remember, we're going to go off to the left side, knock on the old TIE fighter door again. Ew, it's us. Uh, remember me? <laughs> and then inside, it's just easy. You just got to wait for that little pink icon to appear, hit the old, uh, what is it, the B button, and we are, we be on our way with another mini kit. <laughs> okay, boo again. Now, on the back side here, we've got four spots that need destroyed. I only had one extra for some reason. I guess I messed that up. So, hey, don't forget to click that like button down below as uh, I would imagine we're probably providing you some help. And I, and I can't, I don't feel like you're disliking that. I feel like you might be liking that. So, <laughs> if I'm wrong, then forget about it. Don't click it. But if you are, if I am, click it. And uh, what we're doing now is going back to collect some of these bombs. Uh, we need at least one more to, I think it's one more, to go ahead and take down the big wall in the back. Maybe we need more than that. I think we need three, actually. So we'll go ahead and stack up as many as we can as per usual, and then we'll be out of here. I, I like the air brakes too. Did you not notice that? I, <laughs> it's straight up stopped right there. That was awesome. I didn't even know I could do that. All right, back through this canyon one last time. And I think I do go and I blow that up. Now, you're not gonna want, no, I don't. I go right into the cave. You're not gonna want to go out anyways. And look at that, it's not a cave. Somebody needs to brush their teeth though, huh? Uh-oh. Door is closed. We'll have to disrupt some stuff in here. Good thing for us, it is a double score zone. Now, in the far right corner, you're going to find a blue, it looks like some sort of a canister. It's like gray and blue. Blow it up and collect the kit and then get on out of here. Of course, uh, if you want to collect some more studs, stick around and blow some stuff up. I'm sure he's got a dodgy tum now that we're in there shooting things, huh? Back out we go. We've got three of those bomb, 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 bombs. Look at that. We'll go ahead and take them out. It looks like we needed two. And booyaka shao, we are out of here into the final section here. And all right, as soon as we get in here, hang a hard right and go up in this asteroid. And look at that, get up close to personal and blow up. I guess it was just another asteroid piece or something there. Whatever it is, blow it up and collect the kit. 
Now, if I were you, I would use the save and exit feature and watch all of the collectibles get counted up and not finish this level. You've got enough studs, probably, if you don't, get that true Jedi before you do. But, I, you know, I recommend that because this part is the worst. So check this out. There are guys shooting me from every which way. I need proton torpedoes to take out, like, what, 10 spots in this giant asteroid that just happens to be spinning on its own axis, blocking my path. I wish I could just fly around it. No such luck, though. And I want to mention, too, I also have the invincibility red brick on. So if you've been following us... Uh, all the way through on our journey through free play we actually got that a couple of levels back turned it on and if i wasn't rocking that right now oh ho, 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 death would be ensuing me like you wouldn't believe look at all these tie fighters i'm crashing into walls all sorts of stuff and i can't seem to land any of these i, I don't it seems like it's taken forever and yeah so much for the invincibility my wife was sitting here too when i was playing this and i was like man i just ran in and i got an invincible brick she's like well you just smashed into a giant rock which does make sense we should probably blow up but What's the point of invincibility if we can't, like, be invincible? You know what I mean? Uh, anyways, enough of my rant. We've almost got all of those pink spots removed from the giant asteroid. And then uh, that's actually pretty much it. We just got to fly through the crack here. And then, and then I think it takes us away to the final total, which, yep, here we go. We are out of here. Check it out. Guess what we got? We got that score times four. Un block, 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 block. We also got that true Jedi requirement. Pretty easy at 50k, especially with uh, a 2x and a attract studs on. We did find that double score zone too, hiding inside the belly of the monster. And we collected all of them studs, which added up. Look at that, we're back up. We're gonna spend two and a half million on this brick we picked up here. That's right, the 4x red brick cost 2.5 mil ski. Which, uh, hey, we'll take all the studs we can get from completing that. It looked like a TIE fighter. I'm sure it was a special edition one that I'm missing out on, but. Anyhow, we'll go ahead and take our 100k for both of the other gold bricks. You know we love us some gold. And hey, that is going to wrap it up for LEGO Star Wars The Complete Saga Episode 5 Chapter 3 Falcon Flight Free Play. Hey, head down over to our website or over to our Facebook page. I'm, I don't know what I'm talking about, robot. Just go over, check our social media out. It's fun. We have fun. And more fun than this outro. Anyways, as always, until next time. <laughs> Sweet!